UN experts have looked into the hacking of Jeff Bezos' phone. I don't know if you guys remember, but in 2018, Jeff Bezos' phone was hacked. Right. And yeah. um, basically he came out and he said, he's, you know, he made it public because he was being extorted for money right. because there were certain uh, selfies that he'd taken of, you know, below the belt to <laughs> send to his girlfriend of at himself? the time. Yeah. <laughs> to send to his girlfriend while he was still married. I'm searching Jeff Bezos. <laughs> yeah. <right now. laughs> We've lost Danny, my friends. We've lost Danny. Um, <laughs> but those of you who are still with yeah. me. Um, <laughs> so, um, so, so this all happened in 2018 yeah. and Jeff Bezos being Bezos was like, right, I'm going to get a pro. And they're gonna, you know, you know, make a big deal out of this, and he did. And UN human rights experts have looked at this uh, report and looked looked into the probe, and now they are demanding an immediate investigation wow. because there are allegations that Saudi Arabia's crown, crown mm-hmm. prince hacked Amazon boss's Jeff Bezos's phone. That the Saudi prince right. maybe could have, who knows? It's alleged hacked Jeff Bezos' phone because here's how it all started. Yeah, it's interesting. To tell him how I, I was saw this. Tell him how it became about. Oh. So it was basically that um, a message from a phone number used by the prince um, was has been implicated and he basically sent him like an MP4 file. So um, Jeff Bezos received this. A movie. This, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a movie, a video file. And when this file was sent to Bezos' phone, he opened it and that's how the oh. hacking began. Oh. But there are just so many questions that I have. Like, why does the Saudi why does the Saudi Arabian government and the Saudi Arabian prince want to hack his phone? Right. I mean, I can think of reasons, uh-huh. but you know, this is this is one of those. It's it's like a soap opera. It's like, tell me more. Yeah, exactly. And and they're saying that uh, uh, he was at the same meeting with other uh, international figures, and maybe their phones could have been compromised as well. Mm. It's not just one phone. But I would think the reason I would hack Jeff Bezos' phone uh-huh. is to get a better deal at Amazon <laughs> <laughs> using well, his promo code. Well, it's funny. So, uh, you know, he, apparently that text came through uh, WhatsApp. And yes, so my yes. question oh, is, what is Jeff Bezos doing with the king of Saudi Arabia? What, you know. No, Charlie, that's not a question. You know exactly what he's doing. Yeah. You know, <laughs> yeah. So, so he is, he's so sharing those wonderful And videos. apparently Jeff, you know, like clicked on this and this malware went into his phone. Yeah. Ouch. And so it just shows you, even if you get, you know, a, a text from someone that you trust. Right. Mm. You can't even really click on anything. But here's the thing, right? So Jeff Bezos, in addition to being, to being the founder and CEO of uh, Amazon, he's also the owner of Washington. Post mm. and yeah. relations between the Saudi Ara- between Saudi Arabia the and the Bezos. Yeah. That's oh, right. Wow. Yeah. Bing, 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 yeah. bing, bing. bing. Oh, wow. It's all starting to go. I told yeah. you this is a good story. Yeah, it's a great yeah. story. Like espionage right. and like cyber hacking. Yeah. And yeah. Well, hold on, I get a notification here. Jeff Bezos is trying to send me a phone. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> oh, you better open it. <laughs> yeah. No. He, he, knows, he knows the number at Mornings on the Beach. Let's put him through. Hey, Jeff, how's it going? Yeah. In fact, if you want to join us on Mornings on the Beach, give us a call. 